Okay, if you ever shop at Westtown Mall, particularly Boston store, you may have been greeted by some golden furry friends. No, they are not shoppers, in case you were wondering. <laughs> golden Rule Rescue and Rehabilitation fosters golden retrievers and mixes, working to find them forever homes. So we are joined this morning by Amy Trupke and Jen Vernick, who are here with Golden's Cleo. This is Cleo and this is Jake to talk about the organization's Thanks. mission, the program. Good morning. Good to see you both. Good morning. Good morning, puppies. We appreciate it. Um, <laughs> Goldens are just, a, I mean, we've been talking about this. They're just beautiful animals. But for folks who aren't necessarily familiar with Goldens, Amy, I mean, what, what kind of dog are we talking about here? Well, Golden Retrievers are naturally uh, very friendly dogs. Yeah. They love people, obviously. <laughs> um, that is your typical Golden Retriever. In rescue, though, we also get Golden Retrievers who are less outgoing and who are a little shy. Um, both Jen and I have fostered and eventually adopted shy Golden Retrievers. Um, so we are here today to promote one of our um, dogs in the program who is a shy foster dog. Yeah. Her name is Ellie, right? Yes. Tell that's... us a little bit about her. Um, well, Ellie is um, not a golden retriever. Um, the shelter where we got her from um, <laughs> described her as a golden mix, but we kind of had our doubts. She does have kind of the longer hair and some of the oh, yeah. coat attributes, as you can see, of a golden retriever. Um, we did a DNA test on her. She actually is a Sheltie Chow German Shepherd mix. Whoa. Uh, yeah, so um, she weighs about 44 pounds. She's very sweet, but she is definitely a shy girl. Um, this kind of atmosphere would be very overwhelming sure. for her, so you won't see her at the Boston okay. store. It, it is for us, too. Yeah. <laughs> but, so, Jen, what do people not know about Goldens that, that um, maybe you'd like them to know? They're a great family dog. Yeah. We absolutely love them for their temperament. Um, do plan on vacuuming quite a bit. <laughs> yes, they do shed, though. <laughs> so so they're hair. not a dog. For, if you if dog hair is a problem for you, probably golden retrievers aren't the breed. <laughs> and, and they're big dogs. They need yeah. to get out and oh, move yeah. too. Yeah. Right, so. energetic right. too. Yeah. I'm curious for you guys because uh, uh, Ellie's older, right? She's what, 15, 14? Oh no, Ellie oh, is probably between two and four. Oh, she's younger. Yes. Okay, yes. I apologize. Mm -hmm. yeah. These guys are 10 and 11. Yes. Is it tougher to get? you know even though these guys are gorgeous and just mm -hmm. so friendly is it tougher to get older dogs out the door yes yeah absolutely um, Nor normally I say no training needed but but you're right that people are very hesitant to adopt an older dog because um, of longevity and sure. lifespan right? so if people want to help uh, help your organization what do they do well there's a number of different ways um, we're always looking for volunteers uh, foster homes people for events, um, always looking for donations, um, and we are really looking for that special family that's gonna welcome Ellie into their home. Okay. And you all are gonna be at the mall, though, next week? Yes. yes. Um, October 8th is our next Boston Store Day from 10 to 2 at the Westtown Boston Store, and then um, the Saturdays after that, the 15th, the 22nd, the 29th, and November 5th as well. Awesome. Well, yeah. we thank you guys for coming in. I know yeah. uh, this thank is you so much. a great need in the community, and yeah. we appreciate it. And hopefully folks will help out if they can. Yes, thank you so much for having us. Of course. Jen, Amy, good to see you. We appreciate that. Uh, when